Yo, what's up, YouTube? It is OG, and today we are going to be going back over some more uh, Power League and drafts and stuff. I think you guys liked the last video. I got, like, a lot of positive feedback on it. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to be doing something, like, pretty similar to that. And uh, first off, you guys get to see my bar. So I think earlier today I was, like, just outside of top 10. I might have hit top 10 at, like, my peak. Uh, I won my first game. That was my peak. <laughs> After that, I lost like six games in a row. I'm like back down to 30th now. A few people have gotten Masters. Evelyn got it as well. So three people got it. Patchy, Bobby right up there. I was like pretty high up today, but like I had like the worst like teammates today. I was like, I don't, I don't want to get into it, but it was really bad. Um, and yeah, a lot of like people like literally just throwing games intentionally today too. I don't know what's going on. Hopefully... They add some kind of report system. But yeah, we're going to get into drafts. Alright guys, Dueling Beetles. Hopefully nobody dodges this one. Oh, we're against Bobby and Crying Man. Uh, clickbait, clickbait. Alright, so obviously they have a good team. I think we want to ban, like, Squeak is super, super annoying on this map. Um, Okay, he's going to ban Squeak. I don't think anyone's going to play Cornelius. It's another good one. Maybe, like, Crow, or we could go... Oh, okay, they're listening to me. Uh, I'm not used to this. Uh, Shelly. Okay, Shelly's always, like, a pretty decent ban, besides maybe, like, some heist maps or something. But, uh, okay, so they took out Sprout, and then they had two of the same bans. I think Squeak can be first picked on this map. Um, so yeah, that's fine. I kind of want them to go something like that. And then I need us to go, like, some anti-tank stuff here. Stu's fine. Um... And then we kind of need, like, a strong lane that would be fine into Gus. Because I really want to play Brock. <laughs> no, 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 go Stu, 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 Yeah, yeah, Stu's good. Um, and then let's see if Tacos wants to play anything. I don't really like the Jesse pick a ton. I think it kind of loses lane to, uh, the Gus. But we could go it, because if you get it set up, it's really strong. Um... I'm not opposed to it, I guess. We'll see how it goes. I don't really like... I think Penny, it's really good here. But uh, it's the same thing. Like, you have to get set up and it loses lane to a lot of stuff. So if they go another Squishy... I'm really tempted to go Brock. Just because it'll hard win uh, against the Gus. And it kind of deals with their Barley a little bit. Uh, I think I might go Brock. I'm also like pretty biased too. I think it's like the best brawler on this map into the right matchups it's not like the best matchups like the pan might be a little hard but i think i could keep it at like max range and just kind of poke it down and uh i think the mid is gonna need some help with barley too so that's one of the reasons why i want it and obviously like if they have a throw you want to open the map up so i don't want to open up their right there's okay you'll see the breakable wall that i do i want to break it on my side and then kind of their grass because if i break it on their side it gives them more room to dodge and brock shoots down like narrow lanes so, it makes it, like, harder on me, kind of. <clears throat> so, I do want to be on the Gus lane. Um, but I have a feeling I'll be on Pam. And sometimes it's not really worth the hassle of switching right off the start. And, okay. So, yeah, the Pam is going to take a lot of hits to kill. I think that we should have... I'm going to get... Oh, my super didn't go off, or my gadget didn't go off. That's so weird. So yeah, I'm going to break that now. And we should switch sides. I think I get crying, or he's going to be like one. I got a lot of good hits. Oh, I chained my super, actually. So I'll use it on Bobby now. I'll get crying. Oh, I don't. So I messed up two gadgets already. I don't know what happened with the first one. But yeah, I want to be on crying. I can keep a max range. I can shoot that through the wall. I think I aimed wrong. But I also don't want to use my ammo on them. So yeah, I kind of like... I think the Pam was kind of bailing us out into Jesse. Uh, it's a pretty good matchup for Jesse. I think I can get Brock here. Or Barley here. And uh, yeah, you can see why I like this pick so much, guys. Maybe we hit Bobby with that. I wanted to hit him and... Uh, the turret might be a little greedy but yeah you can shoot through walls like right there we don't need to rush here we can just chill if i can get a kill cool this game is ours right now we're up by like 70 percent. so the last thing we want to do is rush i think i get crying yeah 
And uh, when it's when we secure one kill, then we go up. Unless we're all like one HP and we're gonna throw or something, but yeah, that was really good. Even though I had the bad lane at the start, like you saw how easy it was when I was on crying. It's a really hard lane for Gus. Um, this is why I like Brock so much, though. <clears throat> on this map. All right, so we're gonna do pretty much the same thing. I wonder if they'll switch lanes. Probably not. Yeah. So he's gonna ask for okay. So we're just gonna tap Bobby. He probably I know what he wanted to do there. It looked kind of troll, but he wanted the barley to pop his gadget, uh, just so he could make it through and not just stay at the max range for the brook. So I'm not. Uh, I think I kind of break their wall a bit. It's not the end of the world, but it's not really what we want, you know. Uh, I messed up my gadget again. So this one is where it gets a little dangerous with the bro. When you get... I want him out of the grass. We're switching sides, apparently. Uh, it's kind of rough, but we again, like... We just need one kill, and we can kind of reset. They're not getting set up with, like, an aggro turret or anything, which is nice. So yeah, I am getting close to super. I don't know where crying is in terms of okay he had his big shot uh it's kind of rough switching without knowing he has that because i don't know how many shots i can get hit usually i try counting it but yeah we gotta get a kill here i'm gonna take this out i think i hit him uh that super was kind of close but we're not down by that much. We gotta focus one person. Alright. We really need a kill, guys. We need a Jesse turret and a kill. Our crying is low. I think I get him. We can still win. It's just we got a spawn trap. And I don't want to feed Barley Super. That's gonna give them time in the zone. So we'll get the Pam turret here at least. Our Stu needs to go aggro here, and me and Tacos need to hold. Yeah, that's fine. I can't use my ammo on the Pam turret, because I need it for Bobby if he pushes up. Otherwise, I don't think we have enough damage to kill him. But I can get that, see? But the fire doesn't go through. I think I get it out of this here. See, this is what I'm talking about. We need Tacos to really get a turret. Okay, he didn't get a turret for like a really long time. And, uh, yeah, we got spawn trapped at the start. So that's the only downside about Brock. I feel like I was hitting a lot of shots, but, um, you need position. So I think we can switch. I don't know if they'll switch, but the start was really bad from, uh, our team. Okay, they didn't switch. It's good for us. So we'll hit a shot on them, and my team's dying to Bobby, that's not what we want to see. Alright, so my teammates aren't really doing the best. I'm dead. Yeah, my team's just kind of getting, re like, destroyed really hard. Uh, I don't know what they're doing, honestly. Like. Jesse's a good lane into Pam, but I don't know. And Stu into Barley is kind of fine on open map. We gotta push up here though. He's out of Barley. We can still win. I gotta kill the this guy here. Ah, that really bad. All right, I got one. We can win. Nice, nice. Okay, that's huge. This is actually so winnable. This map is so spawn trappy, so hopefully they can both stay up. And uh, he's close to another turret. I'm gonna just super that and get it out of there. Don't know if he got hit by crying. I don't know how my super didn't kill it, but it didn't. Crying's gonna be one. See, I had to use a lot of my time on that Pam turret, but I think it's fine if they can hold. I have a gadget to help get back in. I think I hit him once with that. Would have been a lot better if I could have got that second hit, but... <sighs> I 
I got him. Jesse Turret? No, I don't know. My team kind of sold really hard at the start, I think. Yeah, I don't know. My Like, I can only do so much. <laughs> I don't want to say I'm cocky, but my team is not really playing the game for a large portion of that game. So, yeah. Alright, guys. Um... So yeah, we got a Bem. Okay, uh, first pick. I think Barley is a good ban here. It's a lot of damage for Heist. You usually don't want to. Okay, you want to try not giving them damage in the first rotation. I think it's really good if they don't draft it. Um, I think Dog's another really good ban. I think Dog is just kind of like pretty. So I think we should go this because it counters the Nita and we can open it up and we can scale. What I do want some damage here if possible. Um, don't know how I feel about M's. I don't think it's the worst. The throwers are banned and it's a tank counter and I don't want to go a tank yet. I think M's is okay. So. It is damage, and usually in heist, I do bad karma. I think it could have... Hmm. Spike would have been okay. I don't like going Rico and Dog together. But I don't think I'd go a tank there. Um, and, you know, Ems does kind of beat Barley. So, I think we could go, like... There's a lot we could go right now. Depending on their last pick, though. I think we go, like, honestly, like, something like... Buzz, like Edgar, um, Edgar's done a lot of play recently, I think even Carl's okay, um, yeah, we just need some damage though, so let's see what he wants to go, maybe I should have suggested something, Spike, I don't really like Spike, it gets countered by half the Brawlers, so yeah, Spike's a pretty bad pick here, I think, because it gets countered by the Rico and the Squeak, and we needed something to deal with the Squeak because it has three free matchups right now. And Squeak, like, I don't know. It's really strong right now. Um, so, we do do more damage than them. Kinda. I don't know. They do a lot of damage, actually. So, Squeak Super is really bad right now because everyone's using the extra damage one. But it still does a ton of damage to the height safe. And then they have Nita Bear, Rico. The Rico gadget does so much. And he has the new Spike gadget, but it's just gonna be, like, impossible for it to get it unsafe i think i'm gonna be aggro and just try getting some position i don't mind getting hit by the rico compared to the nita i don't want to feed it super so i'll take some shots from the rico fortunately my dog is gonna go down it's not very good for me um but yeah like i said i don't want to feed this nita and i'm getting pinched here so yeah i'm gonna kill it uh that's fine though, like, I might see, okay, as long as it doesn't have bear, I don't really care. I'm gonna see if I can get some damage in return. And I just want to hold here, like, uh, I went a little too close there, I'm gonna get hit. But when I get super, then I can kind of, <sighs> whatever, I'm gonna just get damage, because I think we're gonna have a really tough time getting damage. I don't think I can stay though, I have to go back. Because I don't think my team will be defending that well. I hope I didn't give him super or something. I think I gave him super there, yeah. I probably should have stayed on safe there. They defended better than I thought, but you never know if that's like gonna be the game or something. I definitely should have stayed on safe there though. I think it's a little close. Yeah, so. So, yeah, we lost this game. You can see the spike's pretty useless. And, uh, there's nothing to counter the squeak. <laughs> so, I guess I should just stay on safe if I can and hope for the best. Um, but yeah, this is. Yeah, I don't know. A spike was a terrible pick. This guy did a really bad pick with me earlier, too. I don't think he knows how to draft. Alright. 
So we took a bit of damage. I don't think any was it was from the Nita though, really, which is fine. We can pinch the Rico here if he wants to go up. Sorry, my dog's like digging on the carpet. Cash! Come on, buddy, calm down. So yeah. You can see our last pick there is not really getting any value. And I'm probably gonna go down here, but maybe I get a kill. Okay, I got him. Alright, I got all of them. Um No, he should really just try any damage. I'm scared to go on safe and die, but I would really like this. Alright, that is a lot of damage. Yeah, so I got around 30% there. That's fine. The squeak goes on safe, honestly, it might be for the best. I can't die though. If I die, I think we lose. Might see if we can go for some kind of base race thing. I am treated up. And it is a Rico, but okay, nice. As long as they don't feed the bear. All right, I got slowed. All right, our spike did not defend as well as I would have liked. That's a, he can't super safe, otherwise it's gonna be like one shot. See, this is what I was scared of last game when I came back. At least they didn't end the game, but. And our spike, you can just see it's not like able to really get damage. I think I can low-key almost end here, but not quite. Our spike can though, okay, nice. So I had to carry like pretty hard to get that win. Our team comp's not the best, our spike's just losing lane because he picked spike into like two brawlers that hard to counter it. Um, but like you, you guys gotta understand like, cause I play comp, well I, I'm on the bench right now, but like, this stuff is so easy, like, for, like, 90% of comp players to understand, so hopefully you guys kind of learn something, and it uh, makes it easier on you. So again, we don't want to feed the... Our spike died. I'm dead. So I died because I'm trying to play mid and cover for him, but he's just dying. I think we can honestly just base race, like, the squeak on safe, like... It's a good amount of damage, but I don't see how we win this game, like, conventionally. We are just super out-comped. I also think if he can break open the map, it's good. Even though, like, I'm, like, for peeking and stuff, like, the squeak is just hard to dodge. Best case, he goes on the squeak, kind of ties lane, and then I can try winning this side again, because I'm good in Nita. And dog's doing fine as well. He's actually about to kill him. Nice, he killed him. It's really good. I'm gonna use a knockback here. I'm gonna try getting on safe. I'm gonna run at him. And with M's, you want to keep this distance, right? If I can get my super too, it's really good. But yeah, we got a lot of damage there. I think all the damage is actually from us this game. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, I did get him, so I'll be up in time. I'll kill the Nita. There's just a Nita like with damage gear, yeah. Nita with damage gear, Loki does a decent amount. It's gonna try hitting me when I walk up. Hopefully a dog can get it, nice. So we gotta keep Spike off here. Or, uh, sorry, not Spike, Squeak. Please don't die. Nah. Oh, he got him. Maybe our spike gets on safe. That'd be huge. I think he might get on safe. He has the gadget. Yeah, oh, he did. He did. Nice. Good damage. I think we won. I don't think it was off in time. Nice. Okay, that one, we should not have won. Honestly, their cop is a lot better. 
But I got a lot of damage on safe, and Spike had a good play at the end, so it worked out. But yeah, I don't think we have golf. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, dueling Beatles again. So yeah, we drafted this one earlier. Don't really know any of the people in the lobby. Um, but yeah, like I said earlier, I think Squeak is first pickable here, and Penny. I don't. I think like I play a lot, obviously. So. I have seen Penny first pick lose so many times. Uh, it just leaves up, like, it doesn't win lane, it doesn't win mid, and you can, like, counter it so easily, I feel like, with a lot of the other really strong brothers on the map. If you get the turret set up, it's really good, but I don't think it's first pickable at all. Um, that's first pickable, but I think Crow's pretty good into that, and I think we should go Crow, and then if we can get something, look, I can't go Brock yet, but uh, I think wall breaks here are really strong. So that's always an option for the last pick. And even like Griff is good here. But uh, yeah, I think we go Crow 100% into that specifically. Oh, Shelly's open too. So we could go Shelly last too. I think that's a really good sleeper pick. What if you want like something like. Oh, he has level 5 Gus. What brothers does he have? I'll say he could go Shelly maybe. I'm down to kind of try it. Yeah, I think it's okay. Um, I think if we went, like, Gus, it would have been good. Because Gus Crow is a really good combo. And maybe they would have taken Shelly, maybe not. But, yeah, okay, that's good. It's good into Shelly, but we have Crow as well, so I think it's fine. And uh, I think I'll go Gus here, maybe. I can't go Grip. I don't know if I want to go Brock uh, into... <sighs> I don't know. I don't know Cordelius' ma- I don't even know its name, honestly. But I don't know its matchups too well. I can also go Dog. Why don't I try, like, Dog Lane? I haven't played it this season, but I think it's fine. Um, it should be okay in all those lanes. And it's going to... I don't know how it does against Cordelius. I assume it's fine. Um, but I guess we'll find out. <laughs> hopefully it works out. And hopefully we don't feed the loot to any supers, because that's how we lose the game. Oh, I wonder if this is my server, actually. Let me see. Oh, it is. Okay, it's fine. thought it might be EU for a sec. So, yeah, we're against Stu. It's a good matchup for Dog. What makes it good is his bags, obviously. Um, but we have... Oh, okay. So, yeah, he is a little hard to hit with his speed turret. Um... But I think it's fine. I can try bouncing on the mid as well. So I'm going to open that first. Just make the map a little bit bigger. So I did get muted there. Uh, I mean, the Shelly lost my treat, which kind of sucks. At this point, we can put Crow on the lane, though. I just don't really want to get I don't know if I can block it with dog bags or what but nah like my teammates kind of are selling again I think like especially crow I feel like this is such a good crow game bro I don't know. This is like such a perfect crow game. Um, I'm going to try switching lanes, I guess. But I don't know. Like, I don't think he can ask for better matchups as crow here. And I don't know if the Shelly is like, just not doing anything either. But if we can just not all like die or lose position and let them just spawn trap us. And it would be really nice. But it's power league, so... Someone go over there, bro. Go mid. I'll go that side, I guess. Alright, nice. Uh, that's a pretty bad hit to give up, but it's okay. He's gonna get super. 
Okay, so it does go through my bags. You can kill him though, right? And my crow, I don't know. Crow keeps losing these lanes, but I'm gonna open it up. I'm taking the tree. There's no way I'm giving it to these guys again. Obviously, if I get more, I'll give it to them, but. I'd rather, honestly, than give them a treat, break their grass, just so we can keep track of them better. Oh, he does have his super, so I think I'm playing kind of risky. He's so fast, bro. I think both my teammates died as well. Yeah, they did. Maybe I'll go big mid. I didn't mean to shoot that one. Okay, I got him. I don't know what they're doing, but yeah, what's going on over there? I'm gonna break this open. Okay, he wasted his super, but it's okay. Got him. We're all treated up. We should win the game now. So I don't think Dog's the worst than Cordelius. I can definitely beat him, outrange him. Um, but yeah, this game is going to be like pretty contingent on if my teammates want to win or not. Fortunately, but yeah, I think Dog was a really good pick, and I think we 100% have comp here. I think it's just kind of a skill thing going on right now. So let's see if we can keep those lanes. If anything, I want to be on the left lane. Uh, just because I can break it and get that first tree. I don't want to really give it to them. But I do want to push up here. And yeah, he's going to be one shot. Nice slow there. That's a really good slow though. So, don't touch my tree. Don't want to feed Lou. Did kind of feed him, but you know it is a little hard. He is in the speed turret. Uh, nice, I'll kill him there. Okay, I was gonna expire, I didn't need to do that. It's pretty risky, I could have died with my treat. Uh, so yeah, like I said, I'm gonna use the first one on that, and then we can keep track of them. So I know he has short range, I don't know where the mushrooms are. So he is getting kind of tapped. Alright, so I clapped them. So it's fine. We are down by quite a lot of percent. I don't think my teammates were doing very well when I was in the other little shadow realm thing. Gotta use this to get them out of the zone. We are going to die. I don't know. I don't think I have a team, to be honest. Like, again, it's really sad, but I don't think I have a team. I'm, like, on, like, a brawler to make them better, too. I'm getting them treats. These guys have, like... I don't know. Like, I can't. <laughs> I've had it with Fire League for today, man. Like... Uh... I'm really curious what's going on. So I'm just going to watch it over really fast. Whatever, Crow gets a good slow at the start. He definitely should never be getting caught out like that. You don't need to do that. Uh, Shelly's kind of missing everything. It's fine. Alright, Shelly's missing all her clay pigeons and wasting super. We're gonna kill. We're down by a lot, but like it's fine. He should be standing in the zone 100%. He's not standing in the zone. I don't know why. Uh, Shelly needs to stand in the zone this whole time. And... Yeah, this is when I got teleported. My crow, I don't understand how it's losing lane. And then, like, the Shelly just can't kill the Lou that's, like, one shot with clay pigeons. Really weird. And then, yeah, we're down, like, 30%. Nobody can seem treated up crow, by the way. Just gets kind of full clip, feeds Lou super. Yeah, I don't... Surely he kills him, right? Alright, my Shelly died. Yeah, I, I really think our comp's fine here. I think just skill issue. Alright guys, it's gonna be the last game, no matter what. Uh, I know everyone in this lobby besides Ares, kinda. Um, 
the team is pretty decent for the most part. Cat's pretty good. I didn't really have a good experience with Aries in that last game, honestly. Uh, <laughs> laughs nervously. I think we could ban, like, Carl or something. Where's Carl? Carl? It's pretty decent last pick that counters, like, a lot of brawlers that are meta on this map. So I think Wallbreak is very good here. I don't think you should Brock first, though, most of the time. But it's weird because it's, like... No, definitely not Mr. P. Definitely not Bill. I think we I just go Brock, I guess. Okay, like if we go Bill, they go Brock, which counters Bill. They get the wall break, they get more damage. And they can get another good brawler. But we can't go Brock first, I think. Because there's like Max open, there's Shelly open, there's like all these brawlers that can just run it down really fast. Brock's actually kind of decent into that, I think, when it's not... Okay, we got kind of lucky, I think. Um, so... I could go Shelly. I might go Shelly. I think I might go Shelly. Crow's Band, right? Yeah, Crow's Band. I'm going to go Shelly. And... My job is to hold mid. I kind of like the 8-bit. I rock with the cat. Like, it does get countered by Bell pretty hard, but if we ever get on save with Brock 8-bit, I think we just win the game. And it's good into Bonnie as well. And it's, like, so much damage. And it's, like, high HP, too, which is always nice. Um, this is going to be tough, though, if we don't get mid control. So a lot of it is going to be on me getting in the mid at the start and surviving. But it could be hard depending what they go last pick here. Amber, it's not really the best or the worst. There's going to be a point in the game where it's going to be very hard for me. <laughs> Once all the grass gets burned, and I hope my Brock doesn't break grass. Sometimes he will with super. He has health gear on Brock. You never really want to have health gear. There's a lot of better gears. You go shield, I think, are just much better on Brock. You go damage. It's good, your glass cannon, but let me focus. I don't want to lose. I've lost so much today. Like, oh no, my headphones are stuck in the chair. Oh no. Terrible start. Let me in the mid. So he has one. That's pretty good start. The Amber has vision gear on. My band-aid's gonna pop. And I've used two clay pigeons, but we got really good control. My bandit's gonna be back up again. My first shot missed him actually. Uh, it's not really the start. What happened, guys? How did the bell get in? I gotta get off this one. Dodge the mark. So they didn't really. Oh, okay. So yeah, Aries is not on my favorite people to play with in Power League list. He broke my grass. Bro, I need that grass. The trap. I don't know, like, the Brock's kind of selling really hard, I think. It's losing a free lane. And I'm out of clay pigeons. So, it's kind of, it's kind of hard at this point. Alright, I'm going to burn this thing, which is fine. I can't get marked here. The Amber's following me around. It's pretty annoying. I'm going to pop my band-aid. Alright. It's good. They got a kill. You got some damage. It's good. Alright, we got that one. I want to wait for my band aid to come up. Uh, my band aid was like one tick from coming up. Hopefully, they can kill the bell. Don't think he's going to, though. 
We got a block. All right, that was way too close. Like we had a very good start. I don't know. This rock. <laughs> okay, the start was fine. Like I kind of used all my clay pigeons, but I think it's okay. But we really need to get better control. Nice. Oh, kill him, kill him, kill him. All right. Interesting. That's fine. We got really good damage. Maybe I can sneak on it. I can stay alive in the corner. They have to defend me. Honestly, that was so good. <laughs> All right, it's going a little better this time. They don't have a ton of damage, Bonnie. I still have a clay pigeons. I'm gonna apply pressure with him, and I want to stay up until. Don't want to go down here. Nice, good shots, but rock. If I can save my clay pigeons. It's cool. Not, it's fine. Nice, rock's fine. Good. And get venom out, and then we can pinch easy, and maybe I'll get in the corner. I think I end. I do. Alright, so you guys can kind of see Shelly. Like, I want to get in the grass, be a menace, and clay pigeon and get kills. I should not be getting a star player with Shelly in Heist, because it is like safe damage, but I did get on the safe, and yeah. Uh, hopefully you guys can kind of see what I was going for there. Anyways guys, I tilted a lot today, like a whole bar, because you lose more than you gain. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys learned something, and uh, yeah, hopefully the next time I can get like all wins, I've been getting losses a lot today. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you next time. Peace.